Please read the disclaimer. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Bio, and today we're looking at the final Brain in a Jar racing game I'm looking at. Raceway, Drag, and Stock Racing. Yep, the very last one. And, oh dear, it has the same start screen as some of the previous games? Okay. Now, I'm going to be a little bit confused with this one. Because, is it going to be as bad as the previous Brain in a Jar games? Or is it going to be on the same level as Stock Car Crash? Because Stock Car Crash is the best game that Brain in a Jar has developed. And it's the one I looked at yesterday. So, i am be very curious to see... Hmm, let's have a look, shall we? Just to give you a little bit of info, though. Obviously, this one was published by Midas, not a surprise. But it was released on September 29th, 2006. So it was actually released a little, quite a little bit. Keep in mind that Stock Car Crash came out in April. September's a little bit away. What's that? May, June, July, August, September 6th. So this, they've had five months. Five months extra development. Now, don't get me wrong. This is not the final Brain in the Jar racing game they developed. They did develop some other ones. But it's the final one I'm going to be looking at. Well, one of them is like Captain Scarlet, but I'm going to be looking at Captain Scarlet in a different video. And they did do some more, get some other racing games for the Wii, but that's a part of its own series called Maximum Racing. And I'm going to be looking at that series specifically all together. There's five games in that series. I'm going to be all looking at them, and they're all on the Wii, so. So the one I'm only looking at the PS2 ones. And generally speaking, realistically, the only ones Midas did, because uh, well, I know Oxygen Interactive did the first one or two, but Midas did the rest. Captain Scarlet, in case you're wondering, is Bam Entertainment. I'm going to be doing, going to be looking at some Bam Entertainment games uh, specifically at some point soon. So, all right. So what do we have here? We actually have quite a few options. Surprisingly, we have Drag Race, Stock Race, Shootout. Championship, big ramp, time challenges, stunt arena. Hmm, okay. Well, let's do a drag race. Drag low, drag high, drag low, drag high. Dra we'll do drag low. I guess in the casino? Why not? Go. Let's give it a go. Let's see what the, the drag racing's like in this game. Drag racing, if I remember correctly, is just a, a straight. Alright. Well, let's just go. Oh, I did a false start, apparently. I don't know how I did a false start. Well, what was the false start? Okay, let's give it another go. I like how... So, slowly pull forward until the two... Until the top two yellow lights are lit. Wait for your opponent to light his two light... For his opponent to light his two lights. The next three will light very quickly when the last one is lit. Go. That is so bullshit. Just fucking have red, yellow, green, go. Why do you have to have some stupid bullshit? We're going. There we go. We actually done it. Can I just say, look at those wheels? Okay, that controls like shit. I'm going to be honest. Like, I, the, the car was veering ever so slightly to the left, so I did right, and it went pfft. It went pfft. That's, that's literally how I could say it. went <laughs> So let's try stock race. Race against 15 opponents to the finish line. There we go. Just fucking go. Casino, why not? I don't care. Just go. I already, even though there seems to be more stuff going on, I have a feeling the racing's just not going to be there. Then again, we're doing stock car racing here. It should be fucking easy. Got a little monorail going on. Okay, they got a little bit going on with the track. And there we go, we're going. Oh, I don't know why I'm last. Everyone else is all together, and yet my car is like, nope. Right, let's uh, see what the turning's like. Uh, okay. Turning is interesting. Oh god, no, no, no. Almost spun out there.
I don't think there's going to be a way of me catching up with these guys. There's t 10 laps as well. I don't think I'm going to be able to tolerate 10 laps. All right. Well, no. We're just starting to catch up. They're fucking... So oh, my God. There is, there is carnage on the tracks. Get out of my way. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Let's go. Oh, a circle to look behind. I was just like, I wish there was a way to look behind. Well, we're now in position 10 out of 15, so that's not too bad. I don't know if that same thing is going to happen again. I don't see me finishing this race if it's 10 laps. It's fucking going to be too long. Um, again, it's 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 stock car racing. You know, it, it's Daytona. You know. That's the only way you could probably make this exciting is if I started playing Daytona USA theme. Daytona! That theme's fucking great. We've been playing Yakuza 5 not too long ago, and uh, that was that, when that when that theme unlocked for fucking Kiryu's taxi minigame, I was like, oh! You know what I'm fucking playing all the time. Alright, so yeah, as long as you don't do that, what I just did there, and just turn when you go around the corners. The tur turning around the corners is fine, as long as you go into the corner. Okay, that one wasn't great. But you can correct yourself pretty easily. It's fine, I guess, for what it is. Is it better than previous bread and jar racing games? Yeah, well, the, the stock car racing is a little bit. I still would say stock car crash is a uh, is better, but let's see what the other these other modes are like. So what we're gonna, I'm not going to be looking at championship, obviously. So I'm going to have a look at shootout, big ramp, and stunt arena. Time challenge is probably self-explanatory. Start halfway around the track from your opponent. Stay half a lap or more ahead of your opponent by keeping the margin in the green to win. Oh, okay. Interesting. So it's elimination, basically. If I'm too far away from my opponent, or if he's too far ahead, then, uh... Whoa, what the fuck happened? Why? Why, though? Uh, the car did that for no reason. I didn't touch the fucking analog stick. It just started doing that. Was that because I had my thumb down on the fucking X button? Or the A button for me? Well, we're at 5% margin around the opponent. We've got to keep the opponent away from us. He must be behind us. Where's the opponent? What opponent? There's no opponent there. Okay. Confused. There's no opponent there. There's only three laps. I don't know. Fucking... I don't really understand that one. It says there's an opponent. I don't see the opponent. Where is he? Whatever. Uh, Big ramp. Let's give big ramp a go. Stock low... Stock high, or whatever. Who cares? Oh, my mistake. We can't play fucking. We can't play big ramp because it won't let us play big ramp. That's really nice. Thanks, game. Stunt arena, and we can't play stunt arena. Wow. So the game's gonna lock out two modes for you for no reason whatsoever. Fantastic. No, I'm not gonna play anymore. This game is by far inferior to stock car crash. Saying it. Imagine if Carnage mode was locked out. Stupid. The drag race doesn't play very well. The stock race is kind of just meh. Again, it's stock car racing. It's boring. Uh, shootout. Don't really get it. And it locks out big ramp and stunt arena. Wow. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to play anymore. Is it is it worse than stock car crash? Definitely. Definitely. Uh, if you're going to play any brain in a jar game, play stock car crash. And preferably play it drunk with, with friends. That's all I can say. But there we go, brain in a jar games, fucking dog shit. I've been Bio, thanks for watching and I'll see you again, bye bye, see ya bye.